beautiful people I hope you're all staying safe and going well and I hope you're all staying warm as well because as you can probably tell I have a cold all my managers and co-workers have been sick and now I am sick these posters were all custom print from Kmart because I couldn't find any eBay or Etsy or any stores which sold the prints I wanted so just like my last video I don't necessarily have a favorite to least favorite or vice versa order so I'll be showing them in order of release dates first release in 1963 we have a Doctor Who poster. I love posters where all or most characters are included so of course I had to include all 13 Doctors. This was ordered before the 14th Doctor was announced so that's why he isn't included and the War Doctor isn't included either. I did have a hard time choosing which photo of all the Doctors to use but ultimately decided on this one because the colour scheme is amazing and I am really happy with my decision. So this episode of Doctor Who actually came out more recently, but I'm going to keep it next to the first poster anyway. We have this poster from Vincent and the Doctor. Just looking at this poster makes me want to re-watch the episode. I recently went to the Van Gogh exhibition which made me appreciate the art so much more. This year has been an amazing year for me as a Whovian. I met Christopher Eccleston at Supernova and now I have two Doctor Who posters. And next up, we have a very important part of my childhood, the one and only Sailor Moon. This is one of those childhood shows that I can rewatch time and time again without ever getting sick of it. Sailor Mars has always been my favourite character, but I think Sailor Moon herself is a very, very close second. I also think that this design goes really well with a few other posters, such as the Doctor Who one, and even the next poster which I'll be getting to now. An album which hits really really different, and has one of the most amazing covers I've ever seen, is Resistance by Muse. Aside from this album consisting of my favourite songs, it is also my favourite album cover. I'm obsessed with the colour palette and all the symmetry and all the possible interpretations of the meanings behind the image. Muse is actually going to release an album really soon, so hopefully they'll also announce an Australian tour. This one I actually designed by myself, but unfortunately a big part of it was cropped off. This is Reputation, starring my cat, inspired by Reputation by Taylor Swift, which is my favourite album of hers. I know we joke about Kmart quality and Walmart quality, but like, they cropped out half the picture. The website never specified what size your photo had to be. I was inspired by a shirt on Redbubble that said Reputation, so I made this on PixArt. But nonetheless, I am still very happy with it and I hope Reputation Taylor's version comes out soon. The next one isn't everyone's favourite movie, but it helped me get through a terrible breakup and I'll probably get a tattoo in honour of it. This is The Birds of Prey and the Fantabulous Emancipations of Harley Quinn. Apart from that, I love how eccentric it is. I love the music, fashion, colours, etc. Also, it had so many cool promotion posters to choose from, so while I am happy I chose this one, I'm open to getting more. And last but definitely not the least, we have The Mandalorian. So this is my little Grogu plushie. I got him during one of the lockdowns from last year and he's been emotionally supporting me ever since. I binge watched this show with my family in one of the earlier lockdowns, I think it was December of 2020. Yeah, overall I really enjoyed the show and I hope season 3 comes out really soon. And now for the part we have all been waiting for, we are going to put the posters up.
So that brings us to the end of the video. Thank you all so, so much for watching. Please let me know which poster was your favorite and if you have any experiences with printing posters at Kmart. My next video is a part two of decorating my laptop with stickers, which may involve some of these fandoms or fandoms featured in my first video. Once again, thank you all so, so much for watching. I hope you all stay safe and have a great day. Take care of yourselves.